tons of new X and Y info, including new types, new Pokemon, new Joom leaders, and more. Hey guys, Jess here, and this is the Pokemon update from Curse and Maryland. First up, the August issue of Koro Koro was leaked early as usual, and it revealed tons of new info about Pokemon X and Y. And then just one day after the leak, Nintendo went ahead and revealed all the localized info. So here's what we know so far. Five new Pokemon, Pangoro, Inge, Malamar, Swirlix, and Spritzy were all revealed. The official Pokemon X and Y website has details about those, as well as the names localized for other languages besides English. So we'll link that in the description if you want to see it. Two new gym leaders were revealed, Gym Leader Clement and Gym Leader Grant, as well as the professor in the game, Professor Sycamore, and the game's villains, Team Flair. Other info that was confirmed is as follows. Both Xerneas and Eveltal keep the names of Fairy Aura and Dark Aura for their abilities. Xerneas' Geocontrol move is now confirmed to be called Geomancy in English. Eveltal's Deathwing move has been renamed to Oblivion Wing in English, and it's been confirmed that only Eveltal can learn this move. Inke is capable of using the move Topsy Turvy, which is a dark type move that reverses all stat changes on the target Pokemon. Swirlix is exclusive to Pokemon X. It has the Sweet Veil ability, which prevents its teammates from falling asleep in battle, and Spritzy is exclusive to Pokemon Y. It learns the new Fairy-type move Draining Kiss, which does damage and drains the foe's HP. Professor Sycamore will battle the trainer from time to time, and you first meet him in Lumio City, which implies that you're going to receive your starting Pokemon either remotely or from another source besides Professor Sycamore. Gym Leader Grant is all about sports and enjoys mountain climbing, bike racing, and more. Gym Leader Clement is a young gym leader that loves science, and his younger sister is Bonnie. A whole ton of additional features have been revealed about the PSS, most of which was covered in the previous Maryland update, but the newly revealed Photo Spots feature allows you to take pictures while playing the game. And moving on from X and Y info, Maryland was interviewed on Pokemon.com. He talked about his experience as a judge and a competitor in the Pokemon National Championships, and it's a great read, so click on the link in the video description to view the article for yourself. And finally, we wanted to end the video with a fan feature. YouTuber Psycho created an awesome video called Top 10 Ugliest Pokemon. It's hilarious, it's entertaining, it's all around great, so go watch it, and be sure to subscribe to his channel while you're there. Like, what is this? Why does it have so many eyes and so many mouths? Like, what are the purpose for these? That's all we have for you this week, but as always, make sure to subscribe to Curse and Maryland on YouTube if you haven't already, and give this video a thumbs up for Pokemon. Thanks for watching, enjoy the game.